Hey YouTube, so welcome back to my channel. It's Sikudani. <laughs> First of all, I want to apologize. I know I've been gone for a really, really, really long time. Um, a lot has happened. My father passed away. Um, I started school again. It's It's been crazy. So no excuse, but you know, just wanted to give you an update. So, <laughs> As you can see, <laughs> this is my hair. <laughs> can you guess what this is? Can you guess what this is? Well, if you can't, I will tell you. These are sister locks. Yay, yay. <laughs> so I'm back. Uh, I'm back with sister locks. And um, actually, it's it'll be a year on October 15th. Yeah, so that's how you know I've been gone for a really long time. Um, and I do apologize to all my subscribers, old and new. And to my new ones, thank you so much for, for subscribing, you know? Like, I appreciate you. And I will make sure that, uh, that I put out more content um, consistently. That's for sure, okay? Um, so anyways, let's get right in. Yes, these are sister locks. And um, these have been in, like I said, for 11 months now. Um, on October 15th, these will be one. One year old. So if you don't know my story, you can go back to um, one of my old videos and see it. But um, just to recap, uh, I had Sister Locks from third grade, which was probably like eight or nine, um, up to 20, was it 20? Yeah, up to 20. It was right, at, actually right after I had turned 20. Um, and I took them out, uh, I actually handpicked them out, which was a terrible decision, but I did so. Um, and yeah, it, it just, it was a whole thing where it had become like when I was in school, people would just say, you know, oh, Siku, the girl with the locks. Like it was never Siku. It was just the girl with the locks. And that's how you identified me. That's how you knew who I was. And that was really annoying. So, um, and then, like I said, one day my sister, she just came in into church and she had her, oh my gosh, her hair was gorgeous. And she had it permed. I had never seen a perm in person, I don't think, before. Um, especially on someone that I knew. <laughs> so, uh, it was really interesting to say the least. And I almost cried because I had been talking about that I wanted to take my hair out for a really, really long time. And she ended up doing it first. So I was like, I was just like, I couldn't believe that she actually did it. So she did it. And, um... For my birthday that year, she had offered to get mine done as well. Um, my hair permed and everything. So at first I agreed to it and then I decided, eh, no, I don't want to perm, but I do want to take my hair down. So I actually took it down, but I took it down myself. And uh, yeah, the rest is history. So I had my hair uh, loose. I was a loose natural for five years actually before I got my sister locks again and um, I actually had said to myself that I was gonna wait till year 10 of being a loose natural to get sister locks again I always knew I didn't always know but I knew for a while that I was gonna return back to sister locks I just didn't know when um, and then I made it my mind okay year 10 let's go um, oh also disclaimer I do have the fan right here because it is, it's extremely hot so if you see my hair blowing or you hear the wind or something like that, just know it's the fan. Um, so anyways, so this was after my dad had passed away. He passed away June 11th, 2017. So this was, I had like a really rough summer and I was just working in the warehouse. I was miserable, like it was crazy. Um, and I was about to go back to school. I was about to transfer 
uh, I had graduated from community college and I was going to transfer to um, a university. So uh, it was the summer of me transferring to the university and my mom, um, she used to be a sister locks consultant for over 15 years. Um, she suggested like, hey, like, why don't you just get sister locks? And at this time I was wearing twists, I was wearing braids, I was doing, uh, so I was like wearing twists, you know, braids, all of that without taking care of my hair underneath. And that was the issue. So when she told me that, I was like, eh, I still didn't think I was ready. So then she was like, well, I mean, you get braids and twists anyway, and you know, you wear them for months on end and you keep re-upping because the way that I am, I am obsessed with keeping my hair fresh. Like it's, it's a thing for me. I cannot stand having my hair look not fresh. It's just, it's torture for me. Um, so every month, and I'm not kidding you, every month, I would take out my twists and redo them um, because the reason why I didn't do um, what was it called the reason why I didn't get just get the edges redone was because I knew you could see the back and the back wasn't redone so yeah I was a mess right so every month I would go and pay for a new set um, and it was getting ridiculous and my hair stopped growing or it would grow but it would break off as soon as I took it out and you know brushed it or detangled it so that was a mess so yeah my mom she just she asked me like hey why don't you just you know wear a off and I was like eh, I'm not ready yet and stuff like that. I was hemming and hawing and you know, I don't know, I don't know this, I don't know that. And so, um, so I was like, well, I don't know, maybe I'll just pay for it later on in life, in the 10 years, right? Then she was like, well, I think this was a couple days apart. So that's what I said to her. Then um, she suggested it again. And she was like, you know what? Like, I'll do it as your graduation present. And I was like, Hmm. Okay. So when she said that, I started obsessing. So I went on Pinterest. I went on YouTube. Was looking at sister lock um, wearers everywhere. Braid locks. I was looking at it all, right? Um, and I started getting. I started preparing my mind for it because I was like, you know what? This is probably a good decision for me. So I started seriously considering it, studying it. And so I finally came to my mom and I was like, mom, um, so I think I'm gonna take you up on your offer and I'm going to get Sister Lux. She was so excited. <laughs> I was so excited. My grandma was so excited cause she, they loved seeing my natural hair. They didn't like seeing me under wigs and under that, which they don't, they don't, um, you know, they don't bash wig wearers. I don't bash wig wearers. There's nothing wrong with wearing wigs. It is what it is. It, it, you know, sometimes you need that change in appearance. Sometimes you need the weave or the, it is what it is. I, do, I did it all. I've done it all. So I'm not against wigs or weaves at all, but I do think there's a beauty in your natural hair. And so do they. So that's what they were thinking. Um, but they didn't like to see me with wigs on and with braids and twists. They always ask me, why don't you wear your hair? Especially my grandma. Um, <clears throat> so anyways, they were excited. I was excited. So my mom and I made an appointment, like we made an actual appointment to start my locks. And that was October 13th. And it took about three days. Um, you know, obviously so many breaks in between. We had a lot going on. So it took three days. So I finished my hair on October 15th. So that's when I celebrate my anniversary. So yeah, October 15th is the day that my mom completely finished my hair and now you see these beautiful babies before you <laughs> so now this channel is back 
to Sister Locks. Yay! I'm excited. I'm really excited. And um, so I will be doing a Sister Lock Journey video. Um, I also will be doing a couple reviews, so keep your eyes out on that. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And make sure you tell your friends about my channel. Um, like I said, keep a lookout for the videos that I have coming. And I will talk to you guys soon. All right, bye.